Hey guys, Rob Sarno here. First time doing a review. I figured uh, since this is a new item and I got mine and was able to get out today, I'd you know, kind of show you what I've got. I'm, I'm 6'1", 235. I've adjusted the vest. I had to adjust these a little bit. I kind of put them forward, so bring the straps this way. Put one long one in the middle. I've got the waterproof pouch. I have the other ammo pouch, magnetic. All work, they work real good. They just self close. I also put the water bottle pouch, and I'm using my Dog Trip Pathfinder receiver in that pouch. So I'm just keeping it there and I don't have to worry about it. Took a tether to the leather piece here with the tether so it can't fall off anywhere. Um, the game bag releases by undoing that buckle, and then you can get in here. And I put I had like eight water bottles in today well, for the run with the dog in plenty of space that way. But you do have this little latch system here. There is also another little latch here and I can use it or not use it. Doesn't really matter to me one way or another. There's a little clip and you can adjust that clip, hook that in there so it doesn't flap around as much. Your waist belt, I have mine on the lowest setting. Seems to work well there for me. Um, room for play. See. did not feel much weight at all on my shoulders felt it around my waist it's foamed in the back inside take it off here so you've got all those cushioned areas kind of keeps your kidneys warm I'm sure when it's really warm out it feel good back opens up you could put I did not get the water bottle yet to put in here but I'm gonna get a uh, whatever the you know the water sacks um, with the hose and then you have release here and you got a couple clips and a storage area in here to throw some things didn't use any of that today so I would say initial thoughts made extremely well i mean the stitching's all good i've been in uh, some peril and finishing stuff back in time and everything you know looks great that way a lot of thought put into this product i can tell you that with the adjustments here for your shoulder straps so you, depending on the angle that you want them all across the little clip that's for this uh for your bag put there putting on the um moly bags and stuff like that when you haven't done them before it takes just a little bit but just make sure you weave them in and out you know inside the vest then on the little bag the vest bag vest and they stay on there tight i did have shells in it before i took them out already just so i kind of knew what it felt like um there's still you know some extra room for a few more only thing I would do if I was to them to add something, I would put a grommet here and here for those of us who have to wear back tags. It'd be nice just to have two grommet holes, put your, um, you know, pin through instead of puncturing this. Not like the rip stop's going to really bother it, but it'd be kind of cool just to have, you know, one here and one here. Then you have your back tag on there. Other than that, um, I'm a fan so far. We'll see what the season brings, how it does, but I fully expect it's going to hold up. Um, you know, like I said, it's done pretty nice. I'm, I'm pretty impressed with it, especially for the first ones off the shelf sent out to people. Um, pretty cool deal. Any questions you guys more than happy to ask me. And, uh, again, Upland over under vest by Chief Upland.